Dad, I want a new cell phone. Why? I want to make YouTube videos and be famous. Go to work then. No, I don't have time for that. Okay, we'll make a deal. You mow the lawn and clean the toilet. Then I'll give you a new egg phone. Which iPhone? The latest one. Really? The iPhone 15? Yes, that's right. Okay, I'll start right away. The garden is huge. It's going to take forever. Anyway, I have to hang on. This is about my new cell phone. Oh man, I really need to clean the toilet. Remember the iPhone, Lisa. It'll be yours soon. Are you done, Lisa? Yes, I did it. Can I have my cell phone now? Yes, of course. Here is your egg phone. You fooled me. You said I was getting an iPhone 15. That's an egg phone 15. You're stupid. I'm going to my mom. Have fun there. She'll tell you the same thing. We'll see. Mom, can I have a new cell phone? You only got one last year. Yes, but it's too slow. I really need a new one. I'm sorry, but we can't afford that. You're just like Dad. At least I didn't have to clean your toilet. Martin had you clean the toilet? Yes, I almost threw up. I'll talk to him. Hey honey, how are you? Have you already cleaned the toilet? Yes, it's squeaky clean. Cleaner than my teeth. Then why does Lisa say that she has cleaned everything? Lisa helped me out a bit. But she also got something in return. What did you give her? An egg phone. You should be ashamed. Mom and Dad are stupid. I want to work with the new cell phone. I'll also chill out on TikTok from time to time. But how do I get my new cell phone now? I still have 7 euros and 50 cents. Maybe I can negotiate with the store. I'm only missing 1,492 euros and 50 cents. If I'm nice, the seller will definitely give me a discount. The cell phone shop is up there. I'm just being honest with the seller. I'll tell him how much money I have. And I ask him if he can give me a discount. Hello. Welcome to our Apple store. How can I help you? I want to buy the new iPhone 15. Is that what you mean here? Yes, that's exactly it. The phone is perfect. The phone costs 1,500 euros. Do you want to pay in cash or by card? Can you give me a discount? Usually not. But I can make an exception. I can give you a 10% discount. How much does the phone cost then? Now it's only 1,350 euros. I don't have that much money. How much money do you have? I have 7 euros and 50 cents. Is that all? There are 2 cents left in my pocket. Then it's 7 euros and 52 cents. That won't be enough for the cell phone. Maybe I can bribe him. Then he gives me a bigger discount. I think you've lost something. What please? The 2 euros there belong to you, right? Are you trying to bribe me with 2 euro right now? Are you serious? I don't know what you're talking about. It's your money. Get out of my shop right now. 
Can I take the money with me? No, it stays here. Where have you been so long? I wanted to buy a new cell phone. But I don't have enough money. Then you'll have to save some money, Lisa. I'm missing 1,500 euros. It's gonna take forever. What are you going to do now? I'm going to cry in my room. I think we should buy Lisa the new phone. Why is that? She is really sad. She can't think of anything else. Then she should look for a job. Lisa is 13. She's not allowed to work yet. I worked when I was 13. But you're not Lisa. Okay, I'll buy her the phone. But she must earn it. What do you mean by that? She must write A B in the next math test. Then she can have a new cell phone. She's more likely to win the lottery. Then she'll have to try harder. Okay, I'll talk to her. Lisa, I've been talking to Dad. He'll buy you the new phone. Really? How did you do that? Yes, but you have to write A-B in the math test. Isn't it enough if I write A-D? No. What about A-D plus? No, it must be A-B. Okay, I'm going to study all night. Then I'll definitely get A-B. Very good, I wanted to hear that. Are you all right? You look tired. I haven't slept. I studied all night. Good luck with the test today. Thanks, Mom. I can do it. Oh man, I'm really tired. Hang on, Lisa. You must write A-B today. Then it was all worth it. You go in there now and do your best. You can do it. Today we're writing our test. I hope you're well prepared. I made the test extra difficult. Why do you do that, Mr. Coons? Because it's fun. I don't understand the first question. It's not my problem, Lisa. You have 60 minutes for the test. Your time starts now. Oh man. The test is really hard. How am I supposed to get A-B here? Your time is over. Drop the pens right now. When will we get the test back, Mr. Coons? I'll give it to you right after the break. You can outside. The test was really difficult. I didn't understand anything. I'll definitely get an F. Yes, me too. I really need to get A-B. Then I'll get a new phone. The break is over. Now we're getting our test back. Let's go in before Mr. Coons gets angry. Your tests are on the table. A few of you were good. The others were really bad. Cool, I have an A. I really thought I was getting an F. I have a B. What do you have, Samuel? I have a C. Why do I have a D? Take a look at your test. That is unfair. I studied all night. Then you should have started earlier. What are you doing now, Lisa? I'll talk to Mr. Coons again. He must have done something wrong. Okay, good luck with that. Here is Mr. Coons's room. Hopefully he'll give me A-B now. Who is there? It's me, Lisa. What are you doing here, Lisa? Class is already over. I need to talk to you for a minute. Okay, 
but I've only got five minutes. What can I do for you, Lisa? I really need a B in the test. That is super important. You should have studied more then. Can't you just give me a B? I won't tell anyone, I promise. No, you can forget that. What are you doing there? I think you've lost some money. Are you trying to bribe me right now? That's not even ten dollars. Will I get AB now? No, and get out of here now. That's enough now. I need AB. Now I have one. Mom, Dad, I have AB in the test. Really? Are you serious? Yes, look here. It's true, she really does have AB. I'm so proud of you, Lisa. What that can't be. Let me see. You really have AB. Will I get my new cell phone now? But the money was supposed to go into my Ferrari piggy bank. You promised it to her, Martin. She has made an extra effort. Okay, we'll buy your phone, Lisa. I didn't think you'd make it, Lisa. You've really surprised me. Yes, I was surprised too. I guess I'm smart after all. What did Mr. Coons say? He couldn't believe it. He even praised me in front of the whole class. Because the test was really hard. We're going to get your cell phone now. The shop is up there. I've already been there today. Are you sure you want the iPhone? There are also cheaper cell phones. Yes, I want the iPhone. What are you doing here? Are you trying to bribe me again? No, I want to buy the phone. But it costs more than 750 euro. No problem. I brought my dad with me. And he has his credit card with him. Are you sure you want to buy the phone? Your daughter is really cheeky. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? I need to buy it. She got A B in the test. Okay, then I'll get 1,500 euros, please. Here is the money. Have fun with your new phone. Did everything work? Yes, we bought the phone. It's the best day of my life. I do feel a bit sorry for Lisa. She only has AD, but she really made an effort. I know what I'm doing. I'm going to call her dad and invite him over. Then I can tell him that Lisa is making an effort. It's the best cell phone in the world. I did everything right. Lying always works. Is that your phone or mine? I think it's mine. Martin Peters, hello. Hello, Mr. Peters, this is Mr. Coons. What can I do for you, Mr. Coons? I'd love to talk to you about Lisa. Do you have time? Yes, did something happen? It's best if you just come to my office. And please take Lisa with you too. Okay, we're going right away. Lisa, come down here. No, I can't right now. Yes, it is urgent. Come down now. What is going on this time? What's up? I'm busy. Mr. Coons called. He wants us to go to school. Do you perhaps know what this is about? No, I have no idea. Okay, then let's go and find out. Hopefully Mr. Coons won't say that I have AD in the test. Is everything okay, Lisa? You look so tense. No, it's all good. We'll be right there. Perhaps Mr. Coons wants to congratulate you. 
because you got AB. Yes, that may be the case. Hello, Mr. Peters. Thank you for coming so quickly. Yes, gladly. What did you want to talk to me about? It's about Lisa. Oh no. Here it comes. What about Lisa? She really makes a lot of effort in class. Phew, that was close. Don't say anything wrong, Dad. Yes, I know. You can see that in her grades, too. She just got A B the other day. In which subject? Well, with you in math. That can't be the case. Lisa just got A D. No, look. Lisa has A B. That is not my signature. What do you mean by that? Someone falsified it. The test isn't real. Lisa, we need to talk outside. Did you fake the test, Lisa? No, it wasn't me. Be honest. Okay, it was me. But I really needed the new cell phone. And I've made an effort. That's enough now. We're bringing the phone back today. And you're under house arrest for a month. But I really did my best. You lied. You don't do that. Who has the best score in the test? A. Mark. B. Samuel. C. Jonas. Leave a comment.